Hey y'all, welcome back to the Closet Recording Studio for another poem of the day. This poem is We Real Cool by Gwendolyn Brooks. Um, stay, stick around afterwards for a little bonus analysis um, if you need a starting point for an essay or something like that. The Pool Players, Seven at the Golden Shovel. We real cool, we left school, we lurk late, we strike straight, we Sing Sin, we, Thin Gin, we, Jazz June, we, Die Soon. All right, y'all, it's time for some bonus analysis. This poem is genius for you know, thousands of reasons. Um, I'm just going to go over a couple of them here. Um, first of all, the reading of it that I just did is syncopated, right? Um, you could read this. We real cool, we left school, we lurk laid, we strike straight, right? Um, it kind of lends itself to that. The reason I know it's intended to be read the way I did with the syncopated end of the line, like we real cool, we left school, we, like the, where the rhythm feels a little off um, to like typical ballad stanza poetry or whatever. Um, I heard Gwendolyn Brooks read it or a recording of her reading it. So, um, I am doing my best. I mean, I'm obviously not the kind of reader that she is, but I'm doing my best to recreate that. Um, so one of the geniuses is the syncopation of it. Um, it's taking a bunch of lines that in a non-master's hand, um, like Gwendolyn Brooks, um, she is the master, not the non-master. In, in a master's hand like this, they come off in like a jazz song, which is, I mean, you see the jazz here too, right? Um, that I meant to underline that instead of just wiggle it. Um, the jazz right there, right? So in a master's hand, they, they have that rhythm. It has that feel to it too, as opposed to some dumb nursery rhyming thing, which is what this could have been. Um, it is fascinating because it does rhyme at the end of lines. I mean, we all the we's technically rhyme too. Um, but it also has the internal rhymes, so it it is it almost does a a b b c c d d right. Um, it almost does that, but those aren't at the end of the line, so they're internal rhyme a a. B. So it's that's that's another cool, excuse the pun, um, another really interesting thing that she does too. Um, one of the other things, I mean, she obviously has the alliteration here that left lurk late strike straight sings in. Um, Jen, Jazz, June, even though those letters are, look, the G and J are different letters, they still make the same sound. So it's repeating lots of sounds, too. Uh, that adds to the feel of it. But one, another cool thing that she does, though, is the, um, the sounds hook into the next stanzas, right? You have the cool, school, left, lurk, and late, right? Um, all the L's. Let me get a different color here. Um, then you have the the A here and the A here, and then the strike straight, sing, sin. Um, so all those S's in a row. Um, and you have a, kind of an S there, too, with the jazz. Um, but then you have the sin, thin, gin, and then you have the ends, too. The N, 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 and June, and soon. All of those are ends um, that give us the sense that all the, all of them are connected um, in a way that you might not notice on the on the first read through so i don't want to get in too much about the meanings of these um, i think the poem is intended in many ways to capture a feeling of a place um, of pool players that are um, skipping school so they're probably um, between you know, 13 and 17 years old, I would imagine. Um, they skipped school and left um, and went to the pool hall. Um, and singing sin, obviously, at that point, they thought singing at bars and that kind of thing and that kind of you know, pop music, non-religious music was sinful. Um, thinning gin, um, it can, you can get um, both like you're drinking it in the the amount in your glass gets thinner. Um, you can also thin it, like put water in it to, um, or, or tonic or whatever, to um, 
to make it less strong or to make it last longer. Um, so it's it's super amazing. But I just wanted to make sure that you got the the jazz rhythm of this and how how much, despite the fact that all I think all of the words are monosyllabic. Yeah, they're all one syllable words in the poem from here on down. Um, they are almost like drum beats, um, and that are syncopated. They're a little off from what you would normally hear in in poems, which is which is awesome. So I hope that helps. Um, thanks for watching. Um, take care of yourselves and wear masks if you go outside. Be good, guys. This video is a production of Thomason Morris Instruction. The creators of this video would love it if you would like and share this video and subscribe to our channel to help us goose the YouTube algorithm. Thank you for your support.